Hello, my name is Dr. Prasad Raj Dandekar. I head the Radiation Oncology Department at Sir H. N. Reliance Foundation in Mumbai. And today I wanted to discuss with you what is the latest in the radiation therapy in India that's happening. Now, if you know radiation therapy is basically used for treating cancers. It's one of the three or four main modalities of treatment of cancer. Around 70% of cancer patients will need radiation at some point in time. And in radiation, what do we do primarily? It's high energy x-rays that we focus on to the cancer cells and kill those cancer cells. Now, while we are targeting the cancer cells, this x-ray can also then affect the surrounding tissues and thus give rise to side effects. If you notice some you know, years ago, the side effects of radiation therapy were relatively higher and then we had the new technology like IMRT or Intensity Modulated Radiotherapy, IGRT or Image Guided Radiotherapy, Rapid Arc, Radio Surgery and so many of them which have significantly improved the outcomes of radiation therapy for cancer cure and also reduced the side effects for the patients. But now we are at a completely different level when it comes to advancement in radiation oncology. You would have heard artificial intelligence is taking all over the internet and all over the world and that artificial intelligence has now come to our help for treating cancer patients. We are the first hospital in India to launch a completely new way of treating cancer called ethos radiotherapy along with in combination with surface guided radiotherapy. What does this ethos radiotherapy do? Ethos is the latest machine which uses artificial intelligence to help us to focus the x-rays better on the cancer cells. Here we are able to do what we call as an adaptive radiotherapy where every day we will be able to change the way the x-rays enter the patient's body depending on how the patient's tumor is today and how the patient's normal organs are today. So if I were to give you an example, uh, if we are treating say cervical cancer patients or you know cancer of the womb of, the, of, of a woman, uh, we, earlier what we would do is we would create a radiation plan for that patient at the beginning on a CT scan and just make sure that we deliver the same plan every day accurately. But some days the tumor would gradually start shrinking. Some days her urinary bladder could be a little full or less full, there could be gas in the rectum and these changes would make, you know, some dose, the radiation dose that was given would change according to this. Now we have an option of checking what is happening in the patient's body every day and change the treatment accordingly. So ethos adaptive radiotherapy is making the treatment safer, it is making it more precise, it is making it more accurate, we are able to reduce the side effects significantly for patients and it's also three times faster. So the patient uh, is able to come out of the radiation treatment very quickly. The treatment lasts hardly two to three minutes and the patient is done. So we are really very happy to be the first hospital in India to bring this service to patients and we are very confident that with this technology we will be able to serve our cancer patients much better, improve their quality of life and reduce their side effects. If you need to know anything more about this therapy, please get in touch with us. My name is Dr. Prasad Raj Dandekar. I'll be happy to answer all your questions.